So I saw this game called Hill Climb Racing, and I noticed something interesting in it. It had real neck flipping action. And so I wanted to add neck flipping action in my own game, and I noticed that Unity has something called hinge joints. But whenever I played around with it, I got something like that. Eventually, I got something like this. And that is what we're going to be covering in today's tutorial. Real neck flipping action. Alright, so let's get started. First off, we're going to go to component and I mean a game object and create a cube. I'm going to name that cube player and I'm going to resize that so we can see it better. There we go. Now I'm going to create a the, the head, the sphere, and I'm going to um, place it on top of the, the player. And now we're going to um, go to physics and select hinge joint and set the anchor at the bottom of the, the head. So this will be the neck, negative 0 0.5. I'm going to set use spring, set the spring to 10, target position to one, and it's gonna be rotating on the Z axis. So I'm going to set the Z to one and X to zero. That way it rotates on that axis. Now it's gonna need a connected body, but we're not gonna set the player to the connected body we're going to create a uh, new hinge joint, but the player needs a uh, rigid body anyways. So we're gonna go to physics, rigid body, and now we're gonna create a new uh, empty game object and that, the, this is gonna be called the, the joint, is going to be what is connected to the sphere. So we're going to set that joint on where, where it's gonna rotate and set it as a child to the player and go ahead and give it a rigid body in physics. So now it has a rigid body. I'm going to set it to is kinematic and take off gravity. And now I'm going to connect that joint to the connected body. And we're going to get something like this. And that's exactly what we're looking for. But it's, it's a little hitchy. I see it's a little hitchy. So we're going to give it its own layer so it doesn't collide with each other. And I'm going to set sphere to, to ball. This is a layer I created earlier. And I'm going to set player to player. And I'm going to hit yes, change children. And now we get something like this. That's what we're looking for. The real neck flipping action. Neck, neck, neck. So if you want to see how I did that, I went to edit, project setting, physics. And you can see here that the player and the sphere are not checked. So they don't collide with each other. And that's how we get that real neck flipping action. And that's it. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching.